artistsupplysource.com Proud retailer of Kalanok artist brushes, the finest quality Kalinsky sable art brushes from Russia, presents the diameters of natural hairs and synthetic fiber. Copyright 2008, Artist Supply Source Incorporated. All rights reserved. In this presentation we will consider uh, diameters of different uh, hairs and also the diameter of uh, synthetic fiber. So here uh, you, you can see um, scanning electron microscope image of the hairs. Uh, we put different hairs on the substrate. So here, here you can see a Kalinsky sable hair. And here is a Siberian squirrel hair. And here you, you can see um, the tip of um, synthetic fiber which is used in our synthetic brushes and its uh, its tip is a little bit curled. If I go to the right uh, I will see that I also have a hog bristle hair close to, to the syn synthetic fiber. There are a couple of things one can immediately notice. Hog bristle hair has a significantly larger diameter than uh, any of the other hairs we have, like um, synthetic or uh, here is you can see squirrel hair. Another interesting feature here is that uh, the tip of, of the hog bristle hair is flecked or split in two parts. So these flecks are what makes hog bristle hair very nice uh, for distributing paint. Ok, let us first measure the diameter of the Kalinsky sable hair. So here just um, I just put this picture for your information. It's uh, the butt of uh, the Kalinsky sable hair. And now, now let's go to the measurements. So first uh, here we, we measured um, the diameter of the Kalinsky hair at uh, one centimeter from the tip of the hair. So uh, we find the diameter is uh, about 77 micrometers. So now let's go to the next picture. Uh, here we measured the diameter of Kalinsky hair at 5 millimeters from the tip of the hair and it's around 50 micrometers. So now let's go to the tip so here, here is the tip of um, Kalinsky sable hair. Let us zoom in. Okay, and here you, I, I'm not sure if you could see it on your video, but it's um, here we measured the diameter, and it's uh, about 26 uh, micrometers. And we did uh, the measurement of the other hair as well, and uh, tip of the other Kalinsky hair, and. Uh, we found this picture and it's um, here we, we found even a smaller diameter of about 9 micrometers. Now let us perform the measurement of the diameter of uh, Siberian squirrel hair. So here we measured the diameter at uh, 25 millimeters from the tip. It's around 70 micrometers. Let's go to the other picture. And here we measured uh, the diameter uh, at 1 centimeter from the tip of the hair. And it's around 50 micrometers. Uh, here we measured uh, the diameter of the hair uh, at the distance of 5 uh, millimeters from the tip of the hair and it's around uh, 37 micrometers. And here it's um, very interesting, the, dif uh, the distance between two scales um, is around 8 micrometers. 
Uh, we will talk about it in later part of the presentation. Okay, now if we look at the tip of the hair, uh, it's around 7 micrometers in diameter. And if we take the other Siberian squirrel hair, it's a little bit different. It's uh, 13.5 micrometers. And here if I will zoom in on this area, I'll get this picture. Okay, now let us measure the diameter of the synthetic fiber at different distances from the tip of the of the fiber. So here we see um, here we measured the diameter uh, of synthetic fiber at the distance of 25 millimeters from the tip, and it's uh, 105 micrometers. Okay, let's go to the next picture. Here we measured the diameter uh, of synthetic fiber at the distance of uh, uh, one centimeter from the tip of, of the fiber. And uh, the diameter is 93 micrometers. Here we measured the diameter uh, at the distance of five millimeters from the tip uh, of the fiber. And the diameter here is uh, 68 micrometers. So now let us go to the, uh, to the tip. And here, uh, if you look at this picture, uh, we notice a couple of scenes. Well, first of all, the diameter is quite small. It, it is smaller than the diameter of uh, Bosch, Kalinsky, Sable and uh, Siberian squirrel hair. And we also notice that um, it's not straight as, as is in the case of uh, Kalinsky or, or squirrel hair. It is uh, a little bit bent. And uh, we believe this, uh, the fact that the diameter is very small is, is the reason why artists sometimes report that a uh, synthetic brush curl at the tip, forming an annoying hooked shape. Let's now uh, zoom further. And here we are at the very tip and we measure uh, the diameter and it's uh, around 4 micrometers. And now let's look at the other uh, synthetic fiber, uh, synthetic fiber like this. And uh, let's zoom in. And here uh, the diameter at the tip is a little bit larger. It's five micrometers. 